Welcome back, everyone. We're getting lifted into the sky! And now we can't go back down? Oh, wow. How do you go back down, though? What if I wanted to go back? Wait. Ah, oh, shoot. You know, I just thought about something. I could maybe have seen that the way they spend their lives is not that different from humans. Maybe not. These are the beds of winglets. They have funny shapes. I don't even see a bed. Which one's the bed? <laughs> are you the guy I'm talking to? We respect the intention of the ancestor. The ancestor trusts you. Oh, right. I, the ancestor, right. Okay, I remember what he looks like. The ancestor trusted you. We trust you, too. Better. The walls between species are thicker than you would think. Or maybe you can destroy them. I feel that way. Oddly confident, but sure. Green water is flowing in the wall. Oh. Is it now? I gotta say, the music in this village is rather interesting. Certainly sounds a bit different. What is this? Wait, what? Why did I just play the what? No, really, where did I go? Oh, so that's how you go back down. I almost said up, but that's wrong. I mean, going up. I'm going to apologize in advance for any of you who want really long episodes of this. There's probably going to be a few less of those going forward for a little while. I just got to mention that right now because, well, if you don't know already, I'm planning to do a Let's Play of Link's Awakening pretty soon. Oh, there he is. So what's in here then? Yeah, I'm planning to do a Let's Play of Link's Awakening pretty soon. It just came out on Friday. And... I got the game today, well, well, I guess yesterday technically, on Saturday. It's Sunday now as I'm recording this. Sunday the 22nd, yes, that's correct. So, because I'm going to be doing that and this at the same time, I'm going to need to make sure that these episodes don't get too long. I mean, maybe every now and then, maybe there'll still be a long episode, but I'll probably try not to let that happen too often. Just an FYI and a heads up on that. Just in case you wonder about that Warhammer. Hmm. Well, might as well buy it for Miru. Alright, your arm now. Cool. Raises the magical attacking power. Whoa! 30 points! Whew! Use escape rate for magical attack with 20 points. Huh. Interesting items, though. I'm a bit miffed about giving our magic items to the barbaric humans, but it's an order from the ancestor. Oh well. So yeah, just unfortunately probably not going to be too many 40, 50 minute episodes. Probably going to be closer to 30, 35 minutes in that range somewhere. For the most part. Buy some rare stuff. I'm kind of thinking right now, because Link's Awakening is probably going to be short. I mean, I'll, I'll probably mention this when I start Link's Awakening, but I'm kind of thinking maybe like 20 minute episodes. And then maybe I'll go longer for dungeons. Just, you know, I don't know. Something like that. It really won't take too long to beat that game. Unless... I just completely don't remember anything about the game. I guess it could be possible, too. Uh... No, 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 no. I don't want any of those. I don't know. It's a, it's something I'm thinking about right now, but I don't know. Because I don't want to do the dual... Especially since it is a short game, I don't want to do the dual 30s. Because that was pretty tough when I was doing Tales of Vesperia. So maybe if I cut it down another 10 minutes and just save dungeons as they're like their own episode. Like maybe those can be the long episodes. I don't know. But eh. Depends on how things go with that. What is this? Let me show you some cool stuff. What the heck is that? What is this? It's the Archangel. It's the guardian god of the Winglies. The ancestor told me. You say told me, but don't you worship a Tubiru? I don't know. I've never been protected. Maybe I just don't know, though. Okay, end of tour. Interesting. So she has to activate her powers in order to actually open that door. Very strange. But kind of neat, though. I'm not gonna lie. It's kind of neat. What's this? Where does this go? Wait! Oh, that's Guaraha. 
Miru, I knew it. You're coming back to me. Double exclamation mark. You were humans. I guess he hasn't heard yet. So you are the friends of Miru. That's right. This is Guaraha. Gu Gua. Oh my gosh, I keep saying his name wrong. Guaraha, a friend of mine. You said I am just your friend. I'm insulted. Um, we grew up together. You were my fiance. What? Really? I didn't know you had a fiance, Miru. Hmm, there is more to you than I thought, Miru. Wow, what are you talking about? It's true, isn't it? I thought she was still a kid. Hmm. It must be true that the Wingleys have a long life, and they're not as young as they look. I still don't think she really looks like a kid, to be honest, but I don't know. What are you analyzing me for? <laughs> I don't know, why not? What kind of relationship do you have with Miru? Relationship? We were just friends. At first, she insisted on following us. Is that so? We have no time to talk about that. Guaraha, why are you cooping yourself up in here? There are awful things going on outside. As the ancestor told us, the divine dragon has come back to life, hasn't it? Why aren't you defending the forest? <laughs> Jeez. The other day, I let you in the forest, Miru. I am on probation now. Of course, I would defend the forest if I could. Whatever! <laughs> see, though, Miru, it's not his fault. We're going to see the ancestor. You just stay here and be gloomy. Alright, I'll be gloomy. Miru, you have changed. You can be changed too if you go outside, Guaraha. Aye. There is a com commandment for us, Winglies. We cannot do what you want us to do, Miru. Yes, you can! Dot, dot, dot. Mm, she's right. You can, if you want. It's gotta not be so crazy, you know? Is it a decoration for the shelf? Doesn't seem very nice. Ah! Stardust! Yay! Are you still cooping yourself up in here? Hmm. Whatever! Let's get going, Dart! That's the only thing different that happened. Okay. So, I cannot run wherever the heck I please, huh? Wait. They say they are regular beds for Winglies? I still don't see a bed here. Where is the bed? And they look very human-like, so why would they sleep on something that's not like our beds? I don't get it. What is the real difference between a human and a Wingly? They really just look exactly the same to me. It's like freaking humans and half elves all over again. Oh wow, you're telling me if I stepped another step in there, I would have started a cutscene? I did not know that. Father, mother, I'm home! Miru, do you realize what you are doing? So, they are the humans who have deluded you. Don't talk bad about my friends! Miru. I'm still me! I want to protect everybody in the forest in my own way! With Dart and friends! The ancestor believed in Miru, and is allowing the humans to pass through here. You have to believe in Miru, too. Humans over there. The dragon is supposed to be your ally. Winglies and humans are enemies. Why are you trying to defeat the dragon with us? The dragon campaign has been over for four, for more than 10,000 years. Besides, there is no reason for our two species to fight each other. Is there? I honestly don't know. You know, that's another thing too. Darn those can't tell freaking Miru is a Wingly. So... Come on! They're so similar! Why are they separating themselves as different species? Honey, our ideas may be too old. Please take care of Miru. You don't need to say such a thing. I'm the one taking care of them. Oh, Miru is taken care of. Yup! Who? Dart and everybody! I assume there is no time for this. He is right, Miru. Let's get going to the Ancestor. Okay, you are right. 
Your father talks harshly to you, but actually he is happy to see your face. Besides, he likes Dart and friends. Don't be yapping about silly things and just go see the ancestor. Okay, I will! Eventually! Someday I will do that! Your mother is right. Seeing you makes me feel relieved. You are living your own way. Of course I am your only daughter, father. I think a lot. Bye now! Alright. Well, that sounds more like it. What? In this force, we transform the li we transform the life power of trees into magic power. This raised the magic power. Oh, cool. My bed is on the left side. It's pretty comfortable. Oh yeah. I still don't see a bed though. Where is the bed? Your father wanted you to come home, Miru, all the time. Dot dot dot. No matter how much of a failure she is, she is our daughter. There is no other place for Mir to come home to. Father! Stop it. Oh, you look happy. Later, Gator! Later, Gator? So... So it just happens again? Oh. Oh. Here, I'll hug you again! <laughs> I want to hug you a bunch! All right, now what are we doing? Ancestor, how are you, dude? Without using the stone, you cannot use magic or fly. Humans are such weaklings. Wait. What? Are you not the ancestor that I thought you were? Wait, where did I go? Oh, I went in the left. So there was a left and right one. Wow, I didn't know that. Okay. I thought that was the ancestor, though. You gotta use magic. You can't even fly. Well, I mean, you can use magic in dragon form. That must be very inconvenient, isn't it? The room upstairs is for recovering your health. Please feel free to use it. It's an order from the ancestor. Lennis? She's not a wingly from this forest. Oh, so there can be winglies from other parts of the world, too, huh? Lennis, a wingly who we don't know. I thought we were the last of the Winglies. Apparently not. It smells a little bit like wine. Is it actually a barrel? A barrel? Oh? Hey! Yeah! Alright, that's more freaking like it. Show me all your stardust. What's up, dude? Bartle, are you bothering us again? The Divine Dragon can be taken care of by us without asking humans for help. Besides, we have no business talking to a betrayer who ran off to humans. What happened to you? The Bartle I knew was much kinder, and it wasn't like that. My baby sister was killed by... a human. Oh no! My baby sister was influenced by you, Miru, and left the forest believing that the outside world was wonderful. We don't need a human's help. Do you have something else to say? Get out! There might be more people killed now. Good for you. It's a good chance to learn how helpless you humans are. But we Winglies won't die. Our magic powers are past the dragons. You are strong, huh? Don't make me laugh. I wonder if you have noticed you are declining because you cling to the glory of the past. What are you talking about? You can barely fly, and that's about it, right? Maybe you won't think that way after this! Whoa now! Don't do that! Exclamation mark, question mark! No way. Is this the legendary Dragoon? Please let us take care of the Divine Dragon. I'll come back to take care of your baby sister's matter. After my journey has ended. So please trust us for now. The one the ones who flaunt their power disappear when they truly when the truly powerful appear. I am going ahead. Well we cannot even have revenge for our baby sister anymore. The divine dragon cannot be. 
I feel weak in my knees. I cannot move. Is this real? Ah! Oh! You wimp, brother. How dare you humans. Just because you are afraid of our magic power, you are setting the destroyers of old dragoons at us. Silly humans. I'll pass sentence for the sin of killing my sister. I'll annihilate them now. I mean, he's... He's still alive, right? He didn't just kill his brother, did he? That would be rather interesting if he did, but anyway... I heard from the Ancestor. Do you want me to carry you to the upper level? Well, I mean, sure. Why not? Let's go! Let's go to that upper level now, shall we? What's up, Ancestor? How you doing? Are you ready to meet me in combat? We end up going into combat with him randomly. That'd be kind of weird. There's nobody here. Where's the ancestor? I'm right here. <laughs> My body is being healed. Is this the magical healing? I wonder if it is an apology for this this courtesy. Ancestor, sorry we are late. I am here. Welcome, humans and Giganto. I am Blano, the ancestor of the forest. I am the first sacred sister of the Mill Sisu, Miranda. Please forgive our sudden visit. I would like you to listen to our story. The divine dragon is. I know. The divine dragon came back to life in the mountain of the mortal dragon. And there are dragoons that have come to us. It seems that the times won't leave us alone. The messenger from the Crystal Palace and the people who were fated to come here. Our opponent is so enormous we have to combine each of our strengths or none of us will survive. Neither the Crystal Palace nor our forest. You mean... Let us put the power of the Dragoons and our wisdom together. You will let us borrow your Dragon Blockstaff? We don't have the Dragon Buster now, so the Dragon Block Staff is our last resort. We no longer have the power to master that, however. If you, who rule the Dragons, can use it, we can fight against the Divine Dragon. I appreciate your kindness. However, we cannot participate in the battle. We are all that remain. We cannot become extinct. I'm going! I know, you are a Dragoon too, Miru. How does that make sense though? How can a Wingly be a Dragoon? I don't get it, I thought they were supposed to be different entities entirely. Go inside, I will show you the way to the Dragon Block Staff. I'm surprised how trusting he is of us, considering we just randomly showed up. I'll meet you there, Miru. Why aren't we just all going together right now? You are attracted to those humans. Yup. They're really cool. Ancestor. I want to go on the journey with them. And I want to see my mother and father anytime I want. Are you telling me to throw our commandment away? Yes. It is not the right time yet. But eventually in the near future. The time will come when us and humans live together. You can literally do that right now. No one will be able to tell the difference, as we can tell by Miru already. Go with them. As a wingly, go see humans, or better yet, the entire world. Your experience will lead us. Okay, I hear ya. I'll meet you there. Alright, going up. If Miru is the one leading us to the outer world, we're all doomed. Where are those humans leading the world to? It's a good question, really. It must be the flow of time. Only the fates can tell. You can just teleport. That's just so... That's freaking awesome! I want to have teleportation magic. That'd be so freaking cool. What's up, dude? How are you doing? Oh, wait. How did he get here? 
The dragon block staff is sealed in the forbidden land over there. Forbidden land? It is the place where a hideous memory sleeps. It used to be until 11,000 years ago. A palace for us winglies, and it was the place where eternal prosperity was promised. It was called the royal capital Cadessa. Now it is a mere ruin without a name. Why don't you just still call it Cadessa? Are you sure? Is it okay to go in? It is fine. Everything is in the past. I see. We have to do what we can do now. Are you ready? Please wait a little. Yes, we are. I say please wait. Please wait a little. What's wrong? We don't know when the Divine Dragon will come. I feel some monster over there. There is still some magic power left, and it attracts monsters. It won't be an easy road to the Dragon Block Staff. When you are ready, come to me. I'll lead you to the Forbidden Land. Hmm. What about up here, though? Wait, is it the one that never sets? Oh, shoot. We got a viewpoint for that up here, even. That's crazy. This is really nowhere else I can go. All right, let's go to the Forbidden Land, then. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Oh, yeah. Wait. Oh, so it is up there. I thought it was going to be through that door. <laughs> uh, so that's like the activation switch. All right. All right. Come on through. This is the wisdom of the Winglies. Oh, wait. That's Darth that said that. Whoopsie. It's a ruin of their wisdom. Let's go. Alright, yeah, teleport him to another dimension! For a second, I thought he was going to the moon that never sets. Or was he? If we are going to the moon that never sets, would we be meeting the black monster? Hmm, what a place. So, this is the Forbidden Land, the ruins of past glory. Past glory! No remnants of the royal capital remains. What's wrong, Miru? You were shaking. Cause I... I hear the outcries of the people who died here. Are you going to wait in the forest, Miru? Not a chance! No, I'm okay! If I can't get past such a small thing, how will I be able to fight against the Divine Dragon? Hmm, good question. Hey, Dart, we haven't gotten the Dragon Block Staff yet. That's right, it would be all for naught that I brought you here. So we have no way to leave until we complete our task, huh? Alright, let's do it then. Let's see what awaits us in this forbidden land of judgment. Oh, what is this? It's obviously a geyser, but what does it mean? Monsters? Oh no, there's monsters here. We're going to die. Mind purifier, sweet! I can't wait to have my mind purified. Holy crud, we went through that entire room without combat? That's crazy. Alright, what's in here? Combat! Sweet! That's new. Oh yeah, new combat music! Well, it's been a while since we've had a new combat song, but now we finally have it. Fairy Puck? Fairy Puck. Well, hey, what do you know? There are fairies in, the, in this forest after all. <laughs> Go figure! Hard blade. Yeah, eat that hard blade. Mm. I swear, after hearing those other two... Was it two or three regular combat songs? I forgot now. I, I want to say two. But after hearing all the, those same regular combat songs for so long, it feels weird hearing something different finally. It's so unusual. Alright, Puck, prepare to die. Alright. Alright, 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 and alright! Yeah, that was a predictable death right there. Too much damage. Way too much damage. Yes, indeed, we got some damage right now. You missed. How dare you? How dare you, Rose? Why would you do that? 
All right. Counterattack again, huh? Very well. You are dead. Freaking fairies. Interesting victory theme, too. So, new battle theme, new victory theme. Theme? 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 What is a theme? New victory theme. Not bad, not bad. Speaking of themes, the new theme they released in Tetris 99. That Kirby theme. It looks nice. I like the way it looks. <laughs> I don't really like the music attached to it, but it's got some good music. or uh, pfft, Good looks to it. It looks nice. Just the music leaves a little bit to be desired, I'd say. It's okay. It's okay, it's nothing crazy though. I just wish it was a little better. Nothing over there, okay then. What about over here, cool? I guess? Uh, excuse me. Well, alright. We never need to do anything, anyway. We can just move on with ourselves. Moving on, that's another new enemy. That's not a fairy or a puck. So two pucks and one of those guys. What are you though? A spinning head? Huh. Alright, spinning head, prepare yourself. Albert's gonna give you some good old gust of wind dance. Heart blade. Yes, good job, Rose. Yeah, I'm, I'm just gonna totally make Albert do it. I don't care. Uh, ha, hoo, ha, yeah. Hey, Dari, how long are you going to be until you get to level 5, just out of curiosity? Will you be fast? I hope he's fast. What? No way! No freaking way! Pleasure? Give me some pleasure. Dang it, no! Not pleasure! Ah, curse you and your pleasure! I didn't want pleasure today. Maybe you did, but not me. I'm gonna attack with Rose. Okay, hi, 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 hi. Hello. Hello there, Mr. Spinning Head. Would you like a blade that's hard? You won't be able to use it because it's gonna be inside of you. It's kind of bad. You probably won't like it. But maybe you will. I don't know. I guarantee something. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Now that's what I'm talking about. Ooh. All right, so what's over here? What was in this area? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I forgot we were up there. I we were somewhere else. Hmm. Oh, I don't like this. I already don't like this. Where are we going? Which way is the right way? Which way is the wrong way? Okay, so that leads somewhere. I mean, I guess if I see a save, I'll immediately know, hey, that's the right way. You should turn around and go get the other items. I don't want to do that, though. I hope I won't need to do that. Oh, man. Scarecrows, huh? Is that what these other things are? They kind of look like them a little bit. A gnome? Well, excuse me, gnome. So now, gnome has multiplied himself. Cool. And he changed his shape to look like a scarecrow. Also, that didn't really do a lot of damage. Does that mean these things are high in defense? Probably. Dang it, your defense is so high. I'm gonna destroy you. Destruction, what? No, that was supposed to be destruction there. That's wrong, What? what is this? Oh, 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 smack in the face. It was delicious. It tasted so good. Oh my gosh. You failed me once again. Heartblade. Mr. Counterattack himself. You thought you had me, but you really didn't. Bubble up. Wow. Hey, Dart, you should think about learning your next edition pretty soon. Same with you, Rose. Both of you need to learn your new editions pretty soon. I mean, if you learn it, you'll be ready to go for when you get. Maxed out! Oh wait, I had no access to that? Oh! Where is this going? Oh my gosh. Can we confuse me a little bit 
more? Oh, wait, what? I get the weird feeling I wasn't supposed to be able to do that. <laughs> Just a little bit of a hunch that I wasn't supposed to be able to do that. Okay, dancer shoes. I'm assuming that would be for Miru. What is it? Only for Miru? Or can't other people use it? Oh. No, that's just so amazing. Okay, five points less defense for 20 points of agility, huh? I feel like that's worth it, really. Especially if Albert can't use it. Can you imagine if Albert could use it too? Oh, gosh. <laughs> oh, man. Give her the bandit ring and those that stuff. Oh, my gosh. She'd be so freaking fast. It'd be so stupid. Okay, well... Humor me. Miru can use it, right? Probably for women. So Miranda could probably use it as well. Am I right? Yeah, they both have soft boots, so yeah. Okay. Makes sense. Anyway, Rose! You can go ahead and have it. I don't mind losing 5 points of defense or 20 points of agility. That's ridiculous. That's actually way higher than I was expecting right there. Where are we going? Where are we going? Do... Oh crud! I am going the right way! Shoot! Are you kidding me? It's such a large space. No kidding, right? I think we're gonna go ahead and turn around now because I don't want to go this way. Indeed, I wonder what it was for. What was it for? Pongo feels... smells like blood. Blood in a large space. It sounds like a coliseum. Yes, it really was. Oh, yeah? I heard it from the ancestor. I almost thought she was going to say the ancients. <laughs> Once upon a time, it was a coliseum, but it wasn't for regular fights that you won or lost. It was for matches to the death. Winglies would just enjoy the view from above. Of fighters picked from among the dominated humans, dragons, and sub gigantos. Hmm, humans, dragons, and gigantos, huh? I am the offspring of that kind of wingly. Well, it happens. The ancestor told us that this is a mere ruin, didn't he? So it doesn't matter then, does it? Dot dot dot! What happened here happened in the past, no matter what sorrow there was. It is no longer our sorrow. Isn't that right? There is nothing to worry about, Mew. The sins of the past are there just to tell us not to repeat them anymore. Cheer up. Let's focus on moving on. I have to agree with that. I think we should move on. However, we'll move on on the next exciting episode. I'm gonna go ahead and explore that area off screen or something between episodes, I guess. I don't know. I'll go ahead and explore that between episodes, and next time we come back, I'll be either at a treasure chest or back here. I don't know. I guess I could just report my findings. I'll be back here. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Anyway, everyone. Yeah. Let me know. Do you know if I'll find something good? Of course you do, because you've played this game before. Or maybe you haven't played this game before. In which case, if you haven't played this game before, do you think I'll find anything good? I'm gonna say no. I'm probably not gonna find anything good. But you know what? Better safe than sorry. Let's go back, find out what there is, and if there's nothing there, oh well. It's okay. It's all good. Hey everyone, you all have a nice day. I shall see you all later. Bye! Hello everyone, you've reached the end of this video. But before we go for the day, I'd just like to give a quick shout out to our one and only tier 4 channel member, Yan Philip. Thanks for being an awesome and supporting the channel! If you too would like to get your name shouted out at the end of each video and live stream, shout outs are available to all tier 4 and 5 channel members. I hope you all have an awesome day, and I shall see you all later.